being on the offensive line, you're going to have some to do some blocking assignments for some guys that really haven't had a lot of experience carrying the ball. Where do you see that uh, role being uh, kind of the key early on for you guys? I think as long as uh, myself and the whole offensive line, uh, if we go 110%, no matter how uh, amateur the guys are that are coming up, we're still going to be successful, I think, because they still, uh, if they go 110%, we go 110%, they should be uh, all right because it's all about effort. Um, as long as they keep pushing through, we should. I think we should be all right, though. I've been hearing about a lot about this uh, new and improved defense that you guys have kind of worked on in the off season. Uh, can you talk to a little bit about that or that unit? Uh, what's been going on there? Uh, yeah, in the years past, we were trying to be more of a, a bend but not break defense. Uh, kind of, I mean, take your first downs, take your big plays, but don't let them score. And this year, we're trying to be a, a hard hitting kind of hard nosed team and. Don't, don't let them get one yard at all. I mean, just stuff them right where they start. It's going to be a little bit of a new look offense for you guys this year. Uh, where do you see yourself fitting in right uh, right away under center, uh, kind of running the offense this year? Um, well, kind of changing up the offense a little bit more this year, not running the ball quite as much, but still sticking with the run and mixing in the pass as well. What's your early season read on the EDC this year, Troy? Uh, where do you see that conference uh, at the end of the year? You know, I think the EDC is very competitive this year. I think more so than years past, it's it's very balanced. I don't think any, you know, if you look at the last handful of years, every team you could kind of identify who was probably going to be on the top or close to the top based on the talent they had and, and the superstars they had. And I don't think, you know, for the most part, everybody's a pretty balanced team and, and there's a lot of good teams, but there's not you know anybody that's really sticking out for the most part and, and every Friday night's going to be a grind and you know there's a lot that's got to play out in the season with injuries and, and all those things so we'll see how it shakes out but I see it to be a very competitive league this year.